The UK will work with Italy and Japan to adapt and respond to the security threats of the future, through an unprecedented international aerospace coalition announced by the Prime Minister today. The Global Combat Air Programme GCAP, is a new partnership and ambitious endeavor between the UK, Japan and Italy to deliver the next generation of combat air fighter jets. The Prime Minister will visit a UK RAF base today to launch the first major phase of the program, which aims to harness the combined expertise and strength of our country's defense technology industries to push the boundaries of what has been achieved in aerospace engineering to date. Due to take to the skies by 2035, the ambition is for this to be a next-generation jet enhanced by a network of capabilities such as uncrewed aircraft, advanced sensors, cutting-edge weapons and innovative data systems. By combining forces with Italy and Japan on the next phase of the program, the UK will utilize their expertise, share costs and ensure the RAF remains interoperable with our closest partners. The project is expected to create high-skilled jobs in all three countries, strengthening our industrial base and driving innovation with benefits beyond pure military use. Rishi Sunak has announced a collaboration between the UK, Italy and Japan to develop a new fighter jet, due to enter service in the mid-2030s, that will eventually replace the Typhoon jet. It is hoped the new Tempest jet will carry the latest weapons. He said, we're one of the few countries in the world that has the capability to build technologically advanced fighter aircraft. But building such a complex aircraft is extremely expensive. Developing the F-35 jet was the most expensive program ever undertaken by the Pentagon, so Britain has been looking for partners. Italy was already on board, and the addition of Japan is a significant move. At a time when Britain is building closer ties with allies in the Indo-Pacific region worried about a more assertive China. Other countries could still join the program. France, Germany and Spain are already working together on their own separate design, as is the United States. Bay systems at Wharton and Samlesbury will play a key role in developing Tempest in Britain. Japan's Mitsubishi Heavy Industries and Italy's Leonardo are among the other companies involved. For the UK, this agreement is not just about security but also economics. The hope is that developing a new fighter jet could create and sustain thousands of UK jobs and open doors to more arms exports.